Hi friends, today in my kitchen, I am going to show how to make Pulichakirai Tokku, Pulichakirai Kadaisal or Gongara Pickle. Let's begin. Keep a pan on the stove and add 1 by 4 cup of sesame oil. Sesame oil is must for the, making this one. And fry garlic. This one is 5 big garlic. I just cut it into half size. Now add small onion. You can add like 6-7 onions. I don't have many so I'm just adding only like 4 onions. Just cut it into small pieces and fry this also. Now add the pulichakirai gongura leaves. It says fermented spinach in English. I'm not sure I'm not sure whether it is correct. So fry this also. If the pulichakirai is sour enough, you don't need to add tamarind. But this one is not that much sour. So I'm adding a small piece of tamarind. And after you wash the leaf, you can just put it in the for frying. So it should have like a little bit of water so it can cook also properly. I made this last summer. My one of my friend, she has a big garden and she has like so many leafy vegetables, mint, gongura, everything. She gave last time and I made it and I was waiting for this time and again she gave this. Thanks to my friend. It is organic gongura. Whenever my mom makes, she cooks the leaf and strain the water because it will be like that much sour. If it is sour, you can do that way. Otherwise, you can just cook it like this. Make sure it cooks really well and then we can just put it in a blender. You can use a food processor. But if you have like a clay pot, you can just smash with a food smasher. But I don't have a clay pl um, pot, so I'm going to put it in a blender. Okay, it is cooked well. Now you can switch off the stove. Keep another pan on the stove and we are going to dry fry. 3 to teaspoon of coriander seeds. 1 teaspoon of jeera. 1 4 teaspoon of methi seeds. Seven. Red chilli. Spice level is up to yours. Add 1 4 teaspoon of asafoetida. Okay, switch off the stove and let it cool down. Both of them has to cool down, then we can grind it. Crush the masala first and then I'm going to add the pulichakirai. Now transfer this into the blender and add some salt. And then blend it, but not as a fine paste, little bit coarse. Add little bit of jaggery also while grinding. Very tasty pulichakirai, tokku, gongura pickle is ready. You can eat this with hot rice. It is very, very yummy. Thanks to my friend for giving me the gongura. And if you like this recipe, share and subscribe my channel. Enjoy. Thanks for watching.